human right in Islam. When we talk of human right in Islam, we are referring to certain rights which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has granted to mankind. This is not peculiar to Muslims alone. It is applicable uh, among the non-Muslims. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has established this rule for us, this rights for us ever since the establishment of Islam. This is telling us that uh, 7th century, when the Prophet Sallallahu came to proclaim, who brought Islam, this right has been with us and it is meant for mankind, it is meant to be, to be practicable among Christians, it is to be practicable among non-Christian, non-Muslim, all, all over the world. Uh, when we look at the Western world, a particular uh, document known as Magna Charta was uh, proclaimed in UK. This is the only basic concept of human rights among the Western world. The professor can be seen in Quran 17, eh, verse 70, and Quran 49, verse 13, inshallah. Other rights with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bestow mankind is right to own and protect property. You being a, you be a human, you have the right to own your property, and, and you are protected by the right of Allah. And importantly, women's rights. The women, our women, has absolute rights. Allah subhanahu wa taala creates both men and women without subordination to each other. The relationship of Allah, uh, that is it. The, we, we, the, when, when dealing with Allah. Eh, the women have the right to observe prayer, while the men have the right to observe prayer.